What if I told you that AI will help brands generate fashion models for their clothing catalogs? Hi. I'm here today to bring you the latest fashion tech news that you need to know. My name is Anina and I'm the CEO of 360 Fashion Network. Before we start, if you want to receive this news roundup regularly then hit that like button and smash that follow as we will be bringing you this news every week to keep you in the know of the top stories we think are important. Alright, first up, Levi's will use AI generated models in its clothing catalog. Levi's wants to implement a new dynamic to promote its clothing. And for this, it will use artificial intelligence. As Levi's statement mentions they have partnered with Lalaland AI digital fashion studio that develops models with the help of generative AI. Levi's wants users to feel identified when they enter its catalog and can see themselves reflected in the models displayed on its pages. So using AI generated custom models will allow them to cover different ages, skin colors, ages, etc. News source Voons another piece of news it's that deep agency a platform Danny Postma describes as an AI photo studio and modeling agency. Using art generating AI, deep agency creates and offers virtual models for hire starting at $29 per month for a limited time letting customers place the models against digital backdrops to realize their photo shoots. It's a photo studio with no camera no real people, no physical location what's this good for? Automating content for social media influencers, models for marketers ads, and e-commerce product photography. News source, TechCrunch. Next up, BBT Toaster, a toaster made specifically for the visually impaired. Designed by a collective of product designers from South Korea this toaster was designed with safety and ease of use in mind creating enough space above the bread inlet to prevent contact with hot metal buttons with braille and positioning that requires minimal movement, and an exterior that reduces thermal conductivity. The intent when designing this toaster was to reduce risk factors and create ease of use for first-time users. Every feature of this toaster is in accordance with the U.S. Disabled Persons Act and is a prime example of how accessibility can be applied to design. News source, Behance and other news. At-home laser therapy, for lasting joint pain relief. Kineon, a technology company and designer of red light therapy devices recently introduced their latest product, Move Plus. This is a therapeutic wearable device that utilizes LED lights and medical grade laser technology to optimize recovery from orthopedic injury. Whether you are struggling with joint pain or experiencing general soreness, this device can offer targeted pain relief and reduce inflammation at the site. What we love about this device is how easy it is to use how results can be felt by users in just one day, and that this can be used by anyone, anywhere because of its relative affordability under 500 and portability. News source, Kineon and the last news item for today. Smart textiles market to reach 16.51 billion US dollars by 2030 due to advancements in material science and technology based on SNS insider analysis the smart textiles market is expected to grow rapidly in the coming years due to the increasing demand for wearable technology sports and fitness applications medical applications advancements in material science and technology and government initiatives and funding they that the smart textiles market had a valuation of 2.97 billion US dollars in 2022 and is projected to achieve a market size of 16.51 billion US dollars by 2030 with a compound annual growth rate CAGR of 23.9 during the forecast period spanning from 2023 to 2030. Smart textiles represent an exciting area of research and development that has the potential to revolutionize various industries. Their integration of technology and textiles provides endless possibilities for innovation and creativity and we can expect to see more groundbreaking applications of smart textiles in the future. News source, Yahoo! Finance. And that's it for today. If you want to get the full top 10 fashion tech news items of the week check out our new podcast 360 Fashion or go to 360fashion.net podcast or search for it on your favorite podcast platform. Don't forget to subscribe so that you won't miss our latest episode.